these things are IBCs, they're a thousand litre tank, and then you just cut them in half, make those things on top, those three things, so they're the grow beds. You can see the water going in there. So in here are yabbies, they're blue claw yabbies, so they're really pretty looking ones, like fluorescent blue. Each grow bed um, gets the water coming out of the sump up to the fish tank, so it's pumped through a black tube there goes into the fish tank and then it comes out into each bed. They're filled with volcanic gravel. So the gravel that we use is kind of really aerated which lets a lot of bacteria grow on it, which is what you want. Broccolis, cabbage, lots of tomato plants along the back that um, the fish poo and wee and create ammonia. Uh, that ammonia is a waste product which gets pumped into these beds. Uh, the ammonia, when it hits the gravel, uh, with the use of natural bacteria that just turn up on it, uh, you cycle a tank for a couple of weeks before you plant or put fish in them. But basically it turns it into a, a nitrite. So the fish are creating ammonia and nitrite, which plants can't consume. And the bacteria that sits on the stones um, basically turns the nitrites into nitrate. And the nitrate obviously is used by the plants, so nice and green and healthy and that kind of stuff. So uh, fish waste turned into plant food and most of it's done with bacteria that are just naturally around and so this is a fish tank in there is um, uh, about 68 uh, silver perch yeah so that's a basic system um, and then I'm trying experiments I've got um, like a different bed over here different system just kind of made out of wood and whatever and I'm trying a pyramid that back tanks another thousand litre tank so the water's getting pumped up the white tube through the middle goes over the top, goes into the fish tank, which comes out of that. The system is at the same age as these ones, and you can see the difference, like, it's just, this is more like hydroponics growing, you know, compared to aquaponics. Um, the difference here is that that back tank has no fish, the tank underneath has no yabbies, so, you can, you know, the difference is just astounding. The plants in here are sparse, you know, that's, you know, they're doing pretty shitty without all that fish poo, there's a massive difference. I deliberately haven't put fish in this one because I wanted to see the difference and, and just see what you know those ones do compared to this one. But having the silver perch in the big tank over there means that you basically just rip off whatever and chuck it in the tank and that's what they eat. Same with the yabbies, they're eating their own, their own food that they're making out of the poo. And the same with the worm farm. You know, the, the worms are also gonna be used to feed the fish when they get bigger. Uh, there's about 2,000 in that. And I'll put another stage on top of it and then separate them and they'll start breeding. So the, the system will basically feed itself with no need to buy any food. And you end up with, you know, 70 fish, uh, whatever yabbies. I think I've got about 10 yabbies in there at the moment. Because uh, yabbies will kill each other if you put too many in them in one go. And uh, yeah, lots of food. So it's interesting stuff. Good fun.